NBC 10's Francis Wang is live at McGillan's in Center City. Francis, great to see you in one of the top spots to celebrate this wonderful holiday. Yeah, Lucy, and it's hard not to smile so big because it's so exciting. So many people here. They've only been open for about an hour, but you can see people already got their beers all decked out. And I'm going to show you what they have set up for us here today to show you all at home. Okay, so they got the corned beef and cabbage. They got the fish and chips, uh, the shepherd's pie, and, of course, their drinks, the O'Hara's Irish Stout, the chocolate leprechaun martini, the Irish potato martini. It is early, but people are up and they are excited and as I mentioned they've only been open for about an hour already packed they were open until 2 a.m. last night just an eight hour turnaround and yesterday actually marked two years since they had to close because of the pandemic now people as you can tell they're so hyped to be here for the 162nd St. Patrick's Day celebration here at McGillan's They've been open since 1860. It is the oldest running bar in the city. It's only been owned by two families. Nobody more excited and happy to be here today than current owners, father and son, Chris Mullins. Well, it feels great. Uh, the crowd is excited to be here. Uh, they were lined up before we were open at 9 a.m. The sun was barely up. And uh, people are very excited to be back inside this year for St. Patrick's Day. to find who's been here on St. Patrick's Day for the longest. It is this family. We have Tim right here and Sean O'Mara. They've been coming, brothers right here, they've been coming for 35 years, St. Patrick's Day. And here's the cutest part. Now Sean, other Sean, his son, comes with them. So an amazing family tradition. Love seeing their smiling faces. They did tell me they didn't come last year, but they are exempt Thank because you. obviously yeah, because of COVID, all right? <laughs> yeah. So it's going to be a fun day here at McGillan's. I'm so excited to meet more people. So many traditions, so many family That's stories. Gosh. Thanks, guys. Keep all right, so we're going to send it back to you, Lucy. Yeah. Enjoy, Francis. Enjoy, family. The pandemic cannot take away our traditions. Absolutely not.